man, that chick is so white. Like, so white. She's not white, she's white. Like, white. Like, I'm talking shark bait, seriously. Uh, what's up? Hope everybody out there is doing good. If y'all living in freaking New England, y'all being smart and uh, staying indoors because it is hot as fuck. It is like, it's 96, 97 degrees. The freaking humidity is up to 77 percento. Uh, I don't have anything to talk about. I just got out of a f close to five hour meeting um, at my job. And of course, you know, it's all the corporate bullshit. You know, they got team effort and all that fucking up your ass shit, really. You know what I mean? It's just like, uh, you know, no. Yeah, it just, it, it, it sucked. It sucked really bad. It, it was just, uh, you know, it, it's just, it's just this group of managers being told what to do by the higher ups above their heads and the little piece of shit like me, we all get the trickle down effect. And it's such, I cannot wait for corporate, uh, the entire corporate system to fail because it is bankrupt and you know it's a uh, you know it's based on a system of oh hey uh, we have to uh, you know we have to do this thing right now you know it's a corporate thing you know like we all have to sign off on it kind of thing oh why because somebody in the higher up area uh, was threatened about their job like hey you know you should be doing stuff and like oh hold on let me make some uh, you know let me make some bullshit up so I can save my job because I really don't have to do it. It's all these little fucks down here have to do it. The little fucks like me. So it was, pardon my French. Pardon my French. I'm just, I just, I'm just, I'm, I've had it up to the top of my kneecap. You know, nobody ever says me and my brother, man. You know, you know, my brother. What's up, Angel? What's up, Running Wind? Um, he always says, you know, everybody's always saying. I've had it up to here, but nobody ever says I've had it up to here, you know, right at you know, the mid part of their knee. So I've had it up to there, you know. Um, but, uh, you know, I think that's my fill line anyway. But I'm sorry about the cursing. I'm, I'm just, it's, it's just so much like five hours of bull for nothing. Um, just for stuff that I already knew. And for papers I signed off on three times already last year. You know, it's, ah, God. So what am I going to do about it? I just, uh, you know, as Jim Carrey said in Liar Liar, he said, I'm not going to do anything about it because if, because if I do anything about it, it's just going to sit and, you know, it's, it's just going to sit and I'm going to end up with a big freaking, you know, salty ulcer and <laughs> so I'll just take it at the, the freaking pipe hole. <laughs> no, take it at the tailpipe. Ha! Whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm just, I, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then, I gotta, like, listen to, uh, <laughs> this jackass from freaking Union try and act like he's, like, so cool, and this guy is full of shit, this guy fucked me over for my health insurance last year, okay, because they made it seem like, okay, hey, you know, you know with, the, with the Union, you know, you have advanced, you know, things that the people who don't sign up for the Union, you know they don't have so I signed up for it and I had I've had spe specific fees and dues taken out of my out of you know out of my uh, out of my paycheck and for fucking what for what um, okay on the 1st of 2016 January I was supposed to get my new health insurance I did not I was like passed over for that right and so I gotta call this guy like I'm not even, I'm not even exaggerating. I had to call him about 19 times and leave messages. Say, hey, this is Kainoa. You need to get back to me. I need to get fucking health insurance. You know what I mean? I signed all your shit. You guys have no problem taking all the fees and the dues and shit like that. But you guys have a problem setting me up. So I talked to him and then, uh, oh, oh, you know, unfortunately, you know, uh, I, you know, I don't have your paperwork on. Me, but uh, if you fill this back up, so look like a nice guy, I fill the shit right back out, right? Okay, you know, I'm gonna try and get it so uh, March 1st you should be able to get health insurance, all right? Okay.
I told him, don't drag your fucking feet now, dude. Don't drag your feet. Right? So, uh, what happens is, um, so what happens is, um, <laughs> gotta chase this that guy down again. It, you know, March 1st, nothing, nothing at all, right? And then, so I find him at my job, like, you know, he's like walking around like some big shot, bothering people while they're fucking working and shit, right? And then, um, I said, uh, I said, hey, what is the deal with my health insurance? I said, I am, I said, I said, I got medications I need refilling. I got, you know, because I don't want to pay top dollar for that stuff, which I have, unfortunately, have to have been doing. So, uh, uh, dude, like, head of the headaches, you know? That guy gives good headache. So anyways, what happened eventually was, he goes, okay, you know what? Um, I need for you to, um, I don't know what happened to the paperwork that you filled out for the March 1st, but um, I need you to fill this back out again. Okay, at this point, we are just before April. We're like March 20th. And I said, you know what, dude? Take all those fucking forms and shove them up your fucking ass, okay? Because by the time... All this stuff goes through all the channels and, you know, everything has to be processed and bullshit. Um, it's going to be April 28th and I'm, and, and the semester is going to be over for me, right? And I'm going to be on unemployment. I'm going to have fucking myself anyway. So I told him, I said, you know what? His name is Thomas. Thomas, Thomas Darby. Thomas Darby. If you ever see this guy, fucking run like hell. He's a big fat fucking pig and he's full of shit. Uh, so Thomas Darby. Uh, he's, like, he's a fucking corporate freaking, um, what do you call them dudes, uh, union fat cats, literal, uh, but yeah, like, you know, they love to talk you into stuff and say, hey man, you know, you're gonna get the benefits, man, if you sign up, because if we don't, you're gonna, you know what, shut the fuck up, so, I saw him, and he's like, Hey, no, I said, yeah, get the fuck away from me. Straight up like that. I just, get the fuck away from me. Don't, 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 don't talk to me about signing back up again. Really, like, like, like you fucked me over. Seriously. And nobody fucks me over, you know? <laughs> nobody fucks with Kainoa. Kainoa does the fucking. All right. Thanks so much for watching. I hope everybody out there stays cool. Crank on all of your freaking ACs because it is unbearable, okay? It is like sticky, you know? I mean, even if you went outside naked you would feel like you had like cellophane like shrunk wrap to your body it, it's 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 bad so uh, i'm gonna get out of the car keep my windows down and uh, go inside the house and get naked thanks so much for watching love you guys appreciate it take care now how do i turn this thing off